Okay, we are back. Toby, can you hear me? Okay, so what I'm going to do is I got uh, this uh, stamp Yanshi letter and a stamp Nanto letter. I'm going to go to Little Thorpe and cash that in, and I can hopefully get the breastplate and girth here. Um, I have a gem somewhere in here. Okay, let me cash this in. Tobe, can you hear me? Okay, so you get these lucky gold letters and then you can also get red ones. Um, and then you get, you do like a one, two, three, four, five, the six different quests where you get these town stamps and then you use the town stamps with the letters and it will, uh, you can cash them in for, um, these different, uh, items. So you can get like a full suit of armor or you can get, well, actually, you know, like you, you got the weapon in your hand. Yeah. So you already did it. Oh, which stamps is this one for the chest plate? Oh, sorry, it's um, it's uh, Nanto and Yanshi, I believe. Nice. Okay, so what did this give me? This gave me this gave me uh armor six and minor creature and then the girth gave me light weapon um oh nice I got two handed six so like I don't even need this ring anymore. So I can replace that. Oh, you only had the Nanto stamp? Yeah, I went and got all the stamps first, and then I'm, now I'm collecting the letters. Okay, one sec. I'm just going to alt-tab and see what else I can give this guy. Okay, if I do a Samshir stamp, I can get a uh, Ring of Quickness also. Which is nice, because there's a level 6 quickness buff on it. Oh, and it also has a minor. Minor quickness. So that's everything that you can get from this guy. Okay, yeah, come down to the bottom and I'm going to summon a portal to town network. I named this stream uh, Revenge, or no, so, sorry, Redemption, because we're going to go back and kick that guy's ass. The guy that killed us like 12 times. Okay, North. I added a little section on the left hand side here so people can actually see what um, what the chat's saying instead of just me talking to like, it looks like I'm talking to myself, you know? So when I upload my video to YouTube, people can actually see what people are saying. It'll be nice. Hopefully it works. This 
this box? Dirty old crate? Oh man, these guys... Are you serious? Oh my god. How did I get one shot? What was that? I think that was a war spell from something? Maybe I should have named this stream instead of Redemption, how to die, how to continue to die in AC. I don't even know what hit me. Okay, I'm just gonna quickly buff up and then I'll be right back. Do I have a combat log anywhere around here? Like, I don't even know how I died. What hit me? Oh. Okay. The Gotrok Teatus got me. Pretty sure that's a Lugian. Okay, I'm on my way back. There's actually some pretty high level monsters here. Okay, I'll be right there. It's coming around the corner. You know, I think the number one thing I need after this is to get Banes, because that's what's that's what's uh, killing me is just not having any Banes on my armor. Look at you! You're just like a hitman over here. Okay. It'd also be nice to get some death items. Do you not have a helmet? Oh yeah, you do. No, you don't. You have it on hide? Hide helmet? Dude, your mullet is sick. I think I'm rocking a mullet too. No, I got the double pony. Can't compete with the double pony. Okay, let's avoid these diamond golems because last time they debuffed the crap out of me. Dude, I'm scared. I'm getting like PTSD flashbacks of jumping off this cliff and dying. At least I can get my body. Oh, there's your body. This place is just littered with our corpses. It's so funny. Look at this. My hands are shaking. My hands are shaking. When you uh got when you got like two shotted here, I jumped off the cliff. And then I died from the fall damage. That's how I ended the last stream. Yeah. 
Oh. I was clicked on the wrong guy. It's all good. We got this. I did a pincer before I started the stream just to get rid of my uh, Vitae. Yeah, um, are you wearing the girth? Yeah, the girth. So this the armor that you got, it gives you level 6 buffs. So when you have the full suit, it's pretty much like every buff you need. That's why it's such a good quest line. And it's, it's no drop too, so you can't lose it when you die. Oh nice, you finally got your axe too. Oh yeah. Yeah, see, this guy's only hitting us for like 7 now. When he was punching us, he was hitting us for like 90. This is crazy. Oh. We got a straggler here. He must be watching the stream. There's no way he just randomly showed up here. <laughs> we got a stage 9 clinger. Sweet, did you want to do this quest with us? We can wait for him to spawn. Just kind of kill the things around here. Nice axes. You guys want to touch axes? You can touch tips? Oh, hold on. I got to remake this fellow. One second. Too high. Oh, there it is. Crossing axes here. This is actually, this would be a good screenshot. And then I have an axe in my head. So it's like four axes here. Oh, hey, I'm level 60 now, or 64. I can get a cape. Okay, you know what? Let's just go in and let's just kill these things. Might even find a couple gold letters. Ooh, there's a chest here. That's well, actually pretty good loot. Need some money, so I'll just sell this stuff. Yeah, you guys, you guys just run around kill and get me XP. I'll just loot this. Don't worry about it. I don't mind. Giwo. Am I saying that name right? Giwo? Gaiwo? Jaiwo? It's, it's Giwo or Jaiwo? Giwo, Giwo, okay, sweet, Giwo. Oh yeah, check out these sweet leggings. Gujia. Gujia? Gujia. Very Japanese. Oh nice, sweet. Yeah, you know what? I've actually had quite a bit of 
uh, quite a few people tell me that they either started playing AC again or they joined the server because of my stream, which is really cool because that's the whole reason I started streaming this game was to kind of bring more attention to it and um, hopefully get more people playing the emulator. I wonder what the spawn time is, time is on this guy. Yeah, it's, it's only about 7 mil you get from this quest, so it's up to you. Because you're almost level 100, so like 7 mil is probably nothing. Not too much. We could always run a couple of matrons after too. Um, so we need to go to... Yeah, let me summon a portal. We're going to go to Dandy's outpost now. I think it's south. Yeah, south over here. So if you just come flying in, that's funny. Oh, we got some shadow bros here. Okay. Actually, I actually have no idea where this guy is. Let me just alt tab one sec. Okay, so we have to go to... Okay, we have to find a guy named Jingeo, but I thought this would take us to like a town or something. We have to look up uh, the chords for this guy. Oh, he's probably in dry reach. Or maybe he's... Is it... Yeah, which way is the town around here? Sorry, not dry reach. Uh, Spaz in the chat saying um, Danby's outpost is just over this way. So east, I think? Hey, Spaz, how you doing? Good to see you again. Oh, I think I see it. Yeah, it's just over here. See some walls. Spaz, were you in the stream earlier? Did you see us die like 20 times trying to do this quest? Oh, my jump's not high enough. Yeah, it was pretty funny. I uploaded the video on YouTube, but yeah. Okay, this is the guy we're looking for. Jingeo. Jingeo, where are you? Oh, here he is. Okay, so um, give him the note that we got off that guy that we killed. Oops, I'm giving him the wrong note. There you go. The heck? What got me? Okay, so you should have got... Um, the Queen's Massive. It's like a note. We have to go bring this to... Uh, let me check. We have to go bring this to... Do, do, do. Okay, we have to go here. So let's go back to Fort Teth and then run there. 
So that will take us to a dungeon and then we have to go to the bottom of the dungeon and give this note to somebody and then they'll give us a weapon. Then we go to San, San Arm or something like that. And then give the person the weapon and then we'll get the experience. I think Fort Teth is probably the closest place to it, yeah. Which is a couple clicks out. Pretty much southwest a bit. Yeah, yeah, that used to be uh pretty scary. And you like use your war magic to pull people over. Hey V, yeah, I just saw you follow me on Twitch. Thanks for coming and joining. Uh V, what's your character's name in are you on uh Levistress too? Oh these uh two Murak troopers look kinda dangerous. I think we have to go in here. They're weak against slashing, which is nice. Okay, someone's hitting me with a bow. Oh yeah, you were Happy Jack, weren't you? Oh, you just got cranked. No, I don't think this is the right place. We gotta go a little bit more south. Pretty much actually straight south from here. Okay, go in go inside the uh, renegade incursion. V, you deleted your guy, Happy Jack. What kind of guy did you make now? Did you remake a mage or something? Okay, we have to find this chick and she's at the bottom of this dungeon. It actually would be a pretty good place to grind, I think. Like, some letters? Yeah, see, I already got a red letter. Because I know these guys drop a lot of gold and red letters. I feel like I gotta, like, release my flow. You guys are both- you guys both have your hair out. How do I do that again? Oh yeah. Settings. Um... There we go. The flow bros. I don't think I've ever done this quest before or been in this dungeon. You guys want to just run through? Oh sh never mind. It's pretty intense in here. Let's just kill them. This is the one thing I like I love about AC quests. It's not like it's not like just one thing where you like go somewhere and just like kill one guy and it's over like there are some quests like that like that but like most quests is like you have to do like multiple level things to go one place get an item go to another place talk to somebody go to another place cash it in
Okay, I think we might have gone in a circle because that just goes back up. Oh, hold on a second. Here she is. Perfect. Okay, so give her the note. Okay, she never gave me anything. Did she give you anything? Oh crap, I think she glitched out. She never gave me the item. Oh no, no, never mind. I got it. Yeah. It was just another note she gave me. It just replaced the one I already had in there, so it looked like nothing happened. Okay, so now we have to take this to Sam. Hold on, let me look it up here. Okay, we have to go back to Jingeo. Hey, what's up, Dave? Welcome back. Oh, this is embarrassing. I swear I never fizzle. There we go. Just don't tell my wife I fizzled that much. She might leave me. Performance anxiety. Yeah, I know. I got all these people watching me try to cast this spell. Okay, um... South. Fizzle when you fizzle. Watch us like get like pretty much no experience from this quest. I've just been trying to look at quests in my level range and just kind of like run whatever just for fun, you know? Even if it's not... Even if like we don't get any good experience or anything, it's still cool to do the different storylines. Okay. We don't all have jump skill like you, Giwo. Just showing off now. Oh yeah, 7.8 mil. That's not bad at all. What is that? Is that like a quest guide or something? Nice. I'll check it out um, later. It actually gave us like me a pretty decent sword if I was heavy weapon, but I'm not. It has crushing blow and biting strike on it. That's actually really good. Yeah, I use a similar guide to that, Giwo. Do you guys want to go run the level 40 and 60 matrons? Oh, um, inspection. Are you talking about, uh, I think it's called assess person. Is that what you're talking about? Can't read your name, name because it's really blue, but let's see. Oh, Deception, yeah, Deception. That was good on Dark Tide. Okay, so let's go to um, the level 40 is, I believe, Nanto. I have a gem here. Let's just run right to the bottom, kill the queen, and then we'll pop over to, I think it's Caribbean or something like that. Is the level 60 matron. Oh, you already did this one?
Yeah, you know what else is a good ringtone? Having uh, old boy, the old boy sound, the ga ga. I don't know what sounds they make, but yeah, something like that. You'll hear it in a second here. I can literally run this dungeon with my eyes closed. Done it like a billion times. Alright, let's get this guy here. So they just announced where I live in British Columbia a whole bunch of new lockdowns because of COVID. So I don't know, I might not have work tomorrow. It would be nice, then I can get some more AC time in, but you know. And masks are now mandatory everywhere, no matter where you go. I was wearing one anyways, but... I know some stores didn't care. But yeah. Oh, you had to get tested, eh, Tobe? Yeah, I already had COVID, like, back in February. It sucked. That was, like, right when it first came out, too. Okay, watch this. I'm gonna summon this first try. No problem. First try here. Here we go, first try. No problem. Easy. Hey, what's up, Cyber Knight? Welcome to the stream. Okay, guys, I think we have to go Garundum. And then it starts with a K. Uh, yeah, this one, Kaban, Kaban. Yeah, you know, I don't think I've ever had to actually say these names out loud. I always just say them in my head when I'm playing the game, and I'm pretty sure I butcher every single town name. Oh, you used to live stream AC? Nice. Yeah, I haven't found anyone to make any AC videos in a long time, so I thought I'd just start doing it. Bring more attention to the game, you know? Okay, we should be able to run down to the bottom of this one, but I don't know. I'm still kind of low level for here, level 65. I might get, I might get wrecked down here, but we'll see. Hey Nate, when you used to stream AC, did you have like, um, like anything particularly you used to do, or did you used to just grind, do quests, kind of what I'm doing right now, or was it more like guides and stuff? Man, being three two-handed weapon guys, we can just destroy in here. Dude, come play again. The game's thriving. Like, this server, uh, Levistress, it's a bot-free server, so you got a lot of guys like... Like right now, you can see we're all just questing. No one's like macro in a corner. It's, it's, you know, it's really good fun. Yeah, it's it's popped, like AC's popped in the last couple months here. Especially with the lockdowns, I think a lot of people are reminiscing about like good old times, you know, playing AC. And a lot more people are just at home chilling, right? Do these guys drop the letters, the red and gold letters? I think any monster over level 80 does. Okay, there's an Ulthoi Icker here. I'm pretty sure that's for a quest. I'm gonna grab it just in case. I remember needing that at some point for something. I'm not seeing any letters here. Um, if you actually go to my YouTube channel, uh, it's just type in Friendly Toad. I have a whole bunch of videos on how to set up AC, download the game, get started. You can even create your own server and whatnot. Check it out. That's probably the easiest way to 
get going on it again. Okay, sounds good, Giwo. Did you pick up one? Or had you like? Did you do it recently, or did you pick up one? Uh, north, and then go right for our work. Just gonna quickly check if I'm available for the stipends while I'm here. Nice, I got it. Did you know about this, Tobe? If you talk to this dude here, uh, once a week you can get a stipend, and then you can talk to this guy beside him, Merid, and he can give you uh, different things, like you can get up, uh, what's it called here? You can get your item spells, um, skill reset, but my favorite is the experience certificate, which gives you a full level. So say, I like to save him for when I'm higher, so like when I'm like, say in the level 200 range, because then when you cash him in, um, you get a lot more experience that way versus like, you know, there's no point in doing that at level 65 because it gives you a full level, right? Uh, Cyber Knight. No, I'm just, they're just in the stream and I just kind of talk and we just play together. Oh, cool. Thanks, Papa. Papa Kilo. Yeah, thanks for joining the stream. Um, that's the whole point of it, you know, just the nostalgia, get people interested in AC again. I'm glad you're enjoying the streams. Tobe, is there any quests that you have in mind that you want to do after this? I was thinking maybe running through Ulthoi Chasm because we we both are lifestone there, right? We could just uh, do like slash lifestone and then go run through it quickly. Oh, you gotta go. Okay, I'll probably just do it by myself then. Leaf Call. I used to play on Leaf Call way back in the. I I'm pretty sure I played on every single server back in the day. My main server was Dark Tide though. And then I went Care Bear for a while on um, on Leaf Call and Thistle Down with my two main servers. Okay, sounds good, Giwo. Wow, that was a good experience. I got 38 mil to spend. Put my magic D a bit here. Magics. Yeah, you know, I even played on Morning Thought. I, I swear, I played on every server because I had friends on every single server, so I kind of hop around, but mainly Dark Tide. Uh, maybe, you know, like, it was so long ago that I played those servers, I, I forget a lot of people's names, but. Okay, so this one gives me piercing protection six. This one gives me blade and endurance. And minor endurance. And then this one is piercing. So I think I'll do this robe. Toba, are you going to head out now then? Yeah, my dad got me into it. I, I watched him play when I was like 10, I think, like 10, 11. And then I started getting into it around like when I was like 13. And uh, he was always the guy that just went in the forest in the middle of nowhere and just hunted by himself on Dark Tide. 
and like he he was always stacked like he had tons of salvage tons of armor tons of weapons but he just kept it all to himself by himself in the forest you know sounds good tope thanks for doing the quest with me and enjoy your pizza oh man i could go for some pizza right now but i've been trying to eat healthy lately you know trying to lose some of that covid slash new dad weight uh, my dad is 56 now, I think. Yeah, he's 56 now. It's kind of funny, though, because my dad, he lives his life now like he played AC. Like, he bought 200 acres in Ontario and lives on uncharted land with, like, no cell phone reception, like, in a cabin he built, like, literally just like he played AC. It's funny. Like, he doesn't even have internet now. And I play AC like I play real life too, just running around not really knowing what I'm doing, but figuring out as I go. I'm dancing. Cyber Knight, how old is your son? Cool, cool. Yeah, I'm uh thirty. Nice loaf, nice. Yeah, this. I bet you everyone watching the stream has so many different memories of AC and like different times, different people you played with, and. Oh, I remember this sickle. Oh, you played uh, Ultima Online? Yeah, I played pretty much every single MMO, like old school MMO. I started with, I actually started with AC, then I played e EverQuest. Actually, no, I started with EverQuest, then I played AC, then Dark Age of Camelot, then WoW, then back to Ashron's Call, and back and forth between WoW and Ashron's Call, and then dabbled in a bunch of other ones. Hey V. Oh, Dark Age of Camelot was awesome. I love the realm versus realm. I used to sit on, um, like I was a knight, uh, oh, what was it called? Shadow Blade, I think. Like I was like a rogue kind of guy and I'd sit on the bridge and then every time people would leave the castle, I would just wait and gank them and then like this huge zerg would come and I'd just hide again, I'd go all stealth and stuff.
Hey V, do you want to run a quest? Do you know any? Actually, I was thinking about running through Chasm. Do you want to come with? You could probably still benefit from the XP. What are you doing? Uh, answers? Okay. Papa, no, I didn't play, um, that was Star Wars you're talking about, right? Yeah, no, I never played Star Wars. I heard good things about it. I heard it was very similar to AC. I just wish, um, who is it, Turbine or Warner Brothers? I wish that they actually released the private servers like they said they were going to do. Because they straight up shafted us. And I'm surprised they don't keep AC around. Like, if they even charge like 5 10 bucks a month, I'm sure people would pay to play it. Like, like people would have kept, kept paying for it, I think. Well, even if they did some kind of like free to play like revamp and then just charge people like some minor microtransactions like they could make some good money and the game's still around you know it's not like they would have to revamp much i never got into ac2 no ac1 for life i think i'm out of money sell some of this stuff I won't take any. Weird. Do I have any money in here? Okay, we're gonna do Ulthor, so I'll just get like piercing, acid. I don't know why I don't get my spells. I have life magic and item. It's just I'm too broke. Was AC2 any good? I never really played it. Like, it looked like it was fun. I was just too involved in AC1. Okay, perfect V. Um, I wonder if Fonz is in the stream. Alright, let's go get some pincers. Well, I wonder if this guy's doing the, um, uh, what's it called? The matrons. Oh, it looks like this guy was going to take us to do the matrons again. I literally just did them though. Hey V, do you want to just go run Chasm with me then? Go to the facility hub. By the way, what armor do you have? You look, you're looking pretty slick. You know what, I, I kind of, okay, so like, I actually got an AC tattoo when I was like, I don't know how old I was, maybe 20? 
It was the AC logo, like the main logo. I had it on my wrist and it actually looked sick, but for some reason, I don't know. I just, I got it covered up. I got another, cause I, I have two sleeves on my arms, right? So like I had, I ha like it was taking up space that I needed to get the rest of my sleeve done, like to, um, to like incorporate my sleeve into it, right? And the AC logo was in the way. So I had it l lasered and then I had it covered up which I'm kicking myself in the ass because I kind of wish I had it, you know? Because AC was such a big part of my childhood growing up. V, I lost you, sorry. I'm coming back to the hub. Okay, V, I'm at the hub. I'm like where the buff bot, bot guy is here. Master, the master enchanter. Sorry if sometimes I seem a little bit kind of lost what I'm doing, guys. It's, uh, it's still new for me to be able to like talk, type, read the comments and kind of like figure out what I'm doing at the same time. I'll get better at it, but I find sometimes I'll just like run into like a random portal or just not pay attention. Oh, nice papa. Yeah, I got tons of tattoos. I got my chest done, my both my arms sleeved. Um yeah, lots of work, lots of money. I want to get more. I want to get my son's feet like like on my ribs. Because I got an ink imprint of them. I just wish I never got that AC covered up. Like, like it wasn't like the normal AC symbol. It was the one where it was like an Ulthoid that was shaping the, the, like the AC. And then what actually ended up happening was I got it covered up and then I got an infection because of that. And then so I had to get a cover up of the cover up. So it actually looks really cool now. I got like a big tree and a heart and like a forest going around my arm with and it's like faded in the distance. And I got like um, birds flying and stuff. It turned out really good considering, you know, what it was and like the problems I ran into over here. V but in the level 30 zone, you come back. There's a portal back here we have to go into. V, 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 can you hear, hear, hear me down the hall? hall, hall. You got me on the big screen? What am I projected onto like a 160 foot wall? This 165 inch. Uh oh, I'm frozen here. AV, what am I doing? I'm just kind of like bubbling, loading. The heck? Okay, I'm coming back. I was kind of like frozen there for a second. Okay, I'm back. Yeah. Okay, so we're going to run south. Slightly south and west at the same time. Oh, Fonz is coming? Hey, Alt F4, I'm pretty sure closes the game. Let's see what you're trying to do there. But yeah, I don't think uh I don't think Fonz is coming. I think he's just kind of doing his thing. Oh yeah. Yeah, it's a good one. No, Fonz didn't get the memo.
I think I'm going to tie to the level 40 um, portal once we get down there. And that way, when I do this quest again next day, I don't have to like run through the start because the start one is the most complicated, I think. I'm going to go pick up fawns at Facility Hub. I wish Fawns was in the stream so I don't have to type to him. My buff's looking like 21 minutes. Okay, that's not too bad. Fawns can hear me? I don't think he can hear me because he's not in the stream. God, he has good hair. Can we just take a minute to appreciate this guy's hair? Got the Elvis hair going. Hey, um, anyone in the stream, can you see the stream chat on the left hand side? Because I set it up so people can see it. Yeah, it fawns is. Oh. Yeah. You can see the chat? Okay, perfect. No, right? I like his armor too. I'm pretty sure this armor gives you a bunch of extra health. It was like the go-to PK armor back in the day. Okay, sweet. Thanks. Thanks, Dave and Cyber. Okay, we're going to run this way until we see a tree line. Should be good. I'm lifestoned right by the chasm, but I wanted to run just to bring these guys with me. So, uh, um, pretty much is everyone in the stream, do you guys all play AC currently, or are you playing other games? Cool, cool. What's AC Valhalla? Okay, guys, go east. Oh, Assassin's Creed, okay. Oh, Assassin's Creed, okay. I was thinking AC, I was thinking Ashon's Call. I'm like, AC Valhalla, is that like a, a spin off of AC? Yeah, pretty much mainly playing uh, AC and Smite. I might stream some Smite just to kind of like mix up a bit. Um, but yeah, I'll keep, obviously keep streaming AC, you know, at least until I'm 275. Okay, here's the portal. Bonds, have you... Oh, he just went in. I'm totally going to get these guys lost. Okay, V, just step close to me, okay? Fawn, do you know the way too? Okay, let's collaborate and hopefully we'll find the way down. I'm just going to run down, okay? When, I'm not going to bother fighting anybody. 
Okay, this is the part I always get confused. I'm pretty sure it's this back one. Oh, thanks, Cyber Knight. Yeah, it's been a blessing. Okay, I'm at the drop. I think I lost you guys. Okay, I'm just gonna run down. Maybe there's more than one way to get to it. Okay, this is the one I always get confused on. I think it's uh... I'm just gonna kill these guys. I'll wait here for them. V, are you with Fawns right now? I'm just at the four tunnel split down here. Okay, I see. Oh no, that's actually a different guy. I'm pretty sure it's the northwest um, down ramp. See you later, Papa. Thanks for watching the stream. Hopefully I'll see you next time. It's been good chatting with you. One game I would love to stream is Rust, but I just can't do it. It's way too addictive. Like, I always thought MMOs, like AC and stuff like that, were addictive. Man, Rust, the whole new drug. V, are you guys down at the note? I'm just gonna keep going down. Oh, Toxic, you used to pl you play Rust? Man, I got like a thousand, I think 1100 hours in Rust. Like, I could play that game all day, like, no problem. Because you just want to keep, like, advancing your, um, your base, right? Yeah, I wanted to try out Tar uh, Tarkov. My brother's playing that. Okay, I found fawns. Okay, we're gonna have to do a manhunt. It's gonna tie to this portal quickly here. See, the thing with me and Rust is like, I don't even really care about the loot. It's just, it's the curiosity. I wanna like, I wanna raid people's bases and just get inside to figure out like what's in there. And because I'm so curious and then so like I want to get more explosives so then I can raid but then that takes forever and then I start a raid and I get halfway through but then I have to go do something but I want to keep playing so then I keep playing and then I end up like putting stuff off right because I want to like finish my raid. Hey V do you have portal recall I can meet you at the top and run you down again if you want. I'm gonna portal recall to the top. Yeah, you, Toxic, you know exactly what I'm talking about, right? And like, it's funny, because I played 1100 hours all solo. Like, I never played with anybody. I would just literally grind away, raid people. It's just way too addictive. Like, Ashland's Call, like I, like, I love Ashland's Call, and I can easily get addicted to it, but like, I cannot play for a couple days and, you know, log off no problem. But with, uh, Rust? Man. Okay, V, follow me, okay? I'll try to go slow. We're gonna go down the left ramp here, go west. I think my buff's actually running out. No, we got 12 minutes, okay. So then we're gonna go down the east ramp again. 
There's ramps in the floor. Oh, I lost you again. KV. East ramp, down. And then you're gonna jump. Uh-oh. Gang gang bang here. Okay, jump down the little pit here. Yeah, I just have such an addictive personality when it comes to like certain games, you know? Okay, V, this is where you're going to want to go northwest ramp. Northwest, over here. Then we're going to go down again. Yeah, there you go. Go this way. Okay, so on the ground there's a note here. Pick this note up. You see it? Okay, into the portal. This next one's a lot easier. I think I'm just gonna follow Fawns on this one. I know the way, but I feel like he knows it better. But yeah, I feel now, like, you know, now that I got a son and stuff, I just want to make sure that he's my number one focus and I don't want certain games to be on my mind to kind of, like, preoccupy me, you know what I mean? Like, I don't want to feel like I have to or want to have to play a game. I want to be able to just hop on and have fun and then log off and not even think about it anymore. But games like Rust, it's just always on my mind. Like, I'm thinking, oh, am I being raided? Or like, oh, I wish I could make my base better now. Or I wish I had another hour to play, you know? Maybe I'm overthinking it sometimes, but... Yeah, exactly. Like, you know, back in the day when I was like, you know, 16, 17, I could sit down and play games for like six, seven hours, no problem, not even worry about it. As long as I got all my schoolwork done and, you know, made sure I still played hockey and hung out with friends. But it didn't matter if I played, you know, a, a bunch, right? Um, but now I just want to, you know, make sure my priorities are straight. And it's been like that for a long time, right? But it's easy to slip you know if you're playing like a game like rust or something like that that's super addictive it's it's just kind of always like nagging at the back of your mind oh just like come play you know but like i could stream it and play it and the thing with rust is it's super popular right like if i if i was to stream it i'd probably get quite a bit of views and stuff but for me, it's just, yeah, I'd rather play games like AC and whatnot, and you know, I really don't care that much about the view count. I just play because it's fun, and I stream it because it's fun. It's not like I'm ever going to be like a full-time streamer as my job or anything. This is just like a fun thing. That being said, I did get uh, 
I did become a Twitch affiliate today because I got enough followers and enough views. So that's kind of cool. I think, I don't know exactly how that works, but if, I think if someone subscribes to me, I get like five bucks or something per subscriber. Yeah, yeah, Cyber Knight for sure. The first couple couple years of AC, there was not much sleeping happening. Twitch charges five dollars per sub, and you get fifty percent. Okay, so two fifty per sub, but you know it's. Oh, you know what? We can actually do the next level too. Let's gotta get this letter first. Yeah, so today they actually they sent me an email, and they're like, "Oh yeah, you're now officially a Twitch affiliate." And I was like, "Sweet." Okay, I have six minutes on my buff, so hopefully we can run through here in six minutes. Yeah, this one's a hard left, and then we go down, I believe, or we go straight. Never mind. No, actually, I think we go down. Yeah. I thought. Dead end. I think we lost V. I think it's over this way. So does anyone know what's the difference between someone that follows you on Twitch versus someone that subscribes to you on Twitch? Because I don't think I have any subscribers, but I have like obviously my followers. But you don't get any money for followers. I think you only get money for people that subscribe, right? So do you, like, say I was to subscribe to somebody else, would I have to pay money to Twitch to become, to be able to subscribe to people? Or is that like a free thing? Oh, subscribers pay a monthly fee? Okay. Yeah, like this, like I never used Twitch before I started streaming AC, so I'm not really too sure on all the different, different things that it has, right? I think we're going to have to fight our way out of this one. Dave, those custom emotes, do I have to enable them or are they just automatically enabled? If for some reason I can't heal, I'm lagging here. Uh-oh. Where's the note? Get the note. Okay, perfect. V, I think we lost ya. Don't worry, V, I'll come back and save you. No man left behind.
perfect timing. My buffs are just running out. How do I scroll up here? Um, someone was saying, I think I saw quickly. Oh, he stopped the farm. What a guy. Um, someone was saying that my subs my subscription button's grayed out. So I'm not too sure how to activate that. Uh, maybe once I officially become an affiliate, maybe it'll pop open because they just emailed me today. So maybe it takes a couple days to kind of like activate or something. Yeah, I can see the icon. It looks like a cut. Is that an AC character? I think I see a guy holding a two handed sword or something like that. I can cyber. What's cyber? Are you talking about cyber sex? ASL. Do you remember that back in the day being like, you're like on a, oh, what's uh, what's it called? Those chat sites. And they're like, yeah, like AOL, MSN, uh, MSN Messenger. And you'd be like, you'd be talking to like some girl and you'd be like, ASL, a age, sex, location. Uh, good old chat rooms. I find I say like, um, back in the day a lot, like, oh, back in the day, like I'm only 30. I make it sound like I'm like 90, you know? Okay, V, the note is right by your left ankle. I'm going to portal out of here because I have no buffs and I'm probably going to die if I stick around. All right, guys, I think I'm going to go cash these notes in and then probably call it a night. I played earlier today, too, so I don't want to overdo it. I'm sure my son and wife will be up soon. What was something insane before uh, Mrs. Toad and Baby Toad? So, V, um, just go back to that guy, like, go into the same portal, run to the... I'll give you the cords once I get there. I'm just going to use my Lifestone Recall because I'm right beside the cash-in. But I'll give you the cords where to go. The cash in the notes. Yeah, V, go with Fawns and get the next one, because I think it's worth, like, quite a bit, like, 50 mil or something crazy. I'm just going to go cash this in. Can you, uh, Cyber, can you still hear me? Or is just the screen locked up? Okay, it's working now. Oh man, I'm lost. I can't remember which direction it is. Is it west or east from here? I think it's east. The last thing you heard was me whispering sex. <laughs> oh, that's funny. Yeah, I know you guys were just talking about cybering. I was like, oh, cybering. That was like cyber sex back in the day. Yeah, AOL got AOL and MSN Messenger got weird quick. Okay, I gotta look up the cords to this cache and I can't remember which way it is.
Okay, I think I'm actually... Yeah, I was going in the right direction. Okay, perfect. V, the note's on the ground right before the portal. He might have picked it up already, so you just gotta wait for it to respawn, which is pretty quick. Yeah, thanks, Scott. How you doing, by the way, Scott? Good to see ya, man. I'm actually just finishing up the stream. Cashing in these notes, I'm probably gonna call it a night. I gotta work tomorrow, I think. I'm not 100% sure, because things are kind of locking down right now. Oh, wow, five mil, not bad. What's this one give me? Three mil. And this is the good one, I think. No, that was the lowest one, one mil. But I think we, yeah, we got like 12 mil, I think, from all that. Knight, you, Cyber Knight, you were saying you were gonna subscribe to me? Um. Oh, Scott, you're, you're Giwo. Okay, sweet. Perfect. Yeah, I'm, I'm honestly not too sure how you can subscribe. Um, I've never actually subscribed to anybody on Twitch before, so... Is the button just grayed out, or is it just not there in general? Oh, you don't see the button? Okay. Uh, Dave, no, I I didn't know I had to send them anything. Like I said, I'm new to Twitch, and I just got an email today when I was at the grocery store that said, I. it's like, oh, congratulations, you are now a Twitch affiliate. So I think I finally made all those um, prerequisites to become an affiliate. So I don't know if I actually have to, like, do anything now to, like, activate it. Uh-oh. V, you died. Okay, so I have to send them my bank information, and then they turn on the sub button. Oh, for supporting for bits, okay. So bits are kind of like... Okay, Cyber, I think I would have to, I have to send them some information first before that button's gonna open up. I do have, um... What's it called? On my, I have like a program called Gamecaster that is what I use to stream to Twitch. On there, there's also a donation thing, like a donation um, link. So I don't know if that's different from like the Twitch link, if I have to send them that link or if I have to like set up separately with Twitch. But at the end of the day, I'm really not expecting any kind of donations or any of that kind of stuff. But if the, if Twitch is going to activate it for me and give me free money, I don't mind. I'll take it. If people sub to me and I get half of that, that's pretty sweet. You know, I wonder if I sell all these notes, if I can merge them together for an MMD note, and then I can buy all my life magic spells. Oh, Scott, I'm cutting out for you? Am I cutting out for anybody else? I'm good for you. Uh, Scott, it's probably uh, your internet because it seems like everyone else is okay. Okay, I'll get a hold of Twitch. I'll Maybe I'll send them an email or something and see what they need from me. Because that'd be so cool. Like, could you imagine if I actually got, like, big or something? I don't think I would, but, like, turn this into, like, a full-time job or something. Like, just streaming AC. I know, right? That's so cool, Cyber Knight. So you used to be a Twitch affiliate and you used to make money doing this? Like, honestly, even if it's like, 
you know, if I made like 10 bucks a week just to pay for some coffees, that'd be pretty sweet. Nice, I just had enough for an MMD. Okay, so where's the life magic guy here? Okay, this is the ultimate decision. Do I want my level 4 life magic spells or do I want my level 4 item magic spells? What do you think is more important right now? To be able to bane or to be able to get my life protections on? Because I, the way I'm thinking about it is once I get the full um, society armor or the explorer armor, it will give me all my buffs. But if I get the item spells, then I can actually bane that armor on top of it. See how much this costs. Oh, it's only an MM note. I thought it was an MMD note. Here, let's see what level fives are. Oops. Two MM notes. Huh. I thought it was an MMD for the level fours. Here, let me. This guy sell MM notes? 23. 300 purals. Okay, how much do I get from this guy? 2,500. Okay, let's buy an MM note. Holy crap, you got $100 for your first check? That's insane. You vote for life spells? Okay. The Cyber Knight speaks. We're going to do life. And hopefully we can make enough money to go get items later. Wait a second. It's an MMD for the life spells, for the level 4 life spells. Okay, that makes sense. So, for the level 4 item spells, it's only an MM note because it's, uh, I, I'm guessing because you don't get as many spells. So we might have to do, uh, might have to do item. Because I don't think we can afford the MMD note again. Sweet. I'll organize all these into my hotbar once I'm off the stream. Yeah, Toxic, did you not know about this? It, yeah, it is a good new feature. So like in our work, you can go to these guys and you just message them um, like level 5, level 4, whatever spell you want. And then you pay and you can get them all so you don't have to like hunt down every single freaking like individual spell. And you can also go in here and just buy them one by one if you want. Each town has these guys here, the Screevers. And like this town I think has level 4 jazz. So like you can just buy them all individually. But instead of having to like buy them and then learn them, it's a lot easier just to pay from these dudes here. Thanks, Scott. Um, we'll see. I'm trying to do everything self-sufficient, so I'm going to try to uh, get the money myself, but I might take you up on that offer. We'll see. Yeah, I know my... I, okay, I know. I'm, I'm pretty bad with the looting right now because I'm just trying to run through some quests, but I'm going to I'm gonna try to loot more in the future. Like, once I get to higher-level mobs that actually have loot that's worth, like, um, getting, you know? Yeah, no problem, Toxic. Hopefully you enjoyed watching and, um, you know, maybe you might learn a thing or two that you might not know if you're, like, recently back to the game. Okay, guys, I think I'm going to probably call it a night. I'm just going to organize my spells off camera and then I will... Uh, yeah, probably, probably go make some dinner. Yeah, peas are really good. And they're light. Okay, everyone, have a good night. Thanks again for watching, and uh, hopefully I'll see you around. I'll probably be on hopefully tomorrow night or maybe the next day. The weekend's coming up, so I should have some time to play.
yeah, jewels, gems, pets, yeah, all that stuff is good uh, money. 